what's going so here <clears throat> today I'm gonna do something a little different because of um, time wise and uh, I just wanted to do a change so just a bit ago I was watching the angry bit uh, uh, angry video game nerd and he was talking about the games of Legend of Zelda. Now a lot of people ask themselves, well, um, what, what's the chronology behind that series? And uh, before I recall correctly, there were only three games in existence. The two we know for the Nintendo, which is Legend of Zelda and Adventures of Link. And of course, the Super Nintendo one would be the third game called A Link to the Past. However, more games came around. And I also asked myself, so if these three games were it, how is it that more games started to come about and what would be then the beginning of Zelda? I gotta agree with, with the nerd on this one. It was hard to tell from what point to what point did the chronology start. However, uh, well, because so many games came out, it was kind of confusing. And I was looking into his video and he explained that the games that came out after Adventures of Links were nothing but prequels. So what was the prequel to one, the prequel to another, and it went on like that. It is confusing, but I realized one thing. A couple years ago, uh, I was, I don't know, I, I was at the store looking for something and I was at the book section and I picked up a green book. <clears throat> um, called Legend of Zelda, which is this. And on the bottom it says Hyrule Hist uh, Historia, which means this, um, pretty much this book tells you the history of Hyrule or the beginning of uh, the, uh, the Zelda franchise. I think it came out right after it's 25th anniversary or somewhere around there. Um, and one of the interesting things that I discovered was that the Zelda games we knew from Nintendo weren't the games that started the whole thing. It was the later on games. Um, So, how did it really, what was the first, um, what was the first game? Well, I'm going to give you what I saw the chrono uh, chronology, and believe me, this is an older version. I know there was another updated book. I think um, there was a second book. I don't know if it was the art gallery or it was the updated version. I don't know. I lost track. I never saw that book again. But according to the chronology, <clears throat> uh, 
it was um, the legend of the goddesses and the hero and um, that and um, that that was the beginning of of um of the of the history um starting by skyward sword then the diminishing cup which was the rise the rise of the evil um body the fourth source which was the resurrection of body and then oh yeah uh okay hold on let me go let me get this started okay so in the period of the goddesses and the hero we have the the creation of the land and the sky the ancient battle of the re uh, reincarnation of the goddess uh, Hylia a return to the surface that's found on the sky era so there's the creation era of the goddess Hylia and the sky era continuing from that point is the era of chaos which we have the sacred um, realm of the silid silk then the era of pro, uh, prosperity which is the establishment of hyrule kingdom the fourth era that's where that's where uh, the following game comes in the diminishing cap which marks the rise of the body the four the four swords which is the uh the recre uh, resurrection of body and then on the era of hero of time the child era to the adult era we have uh, the whole uh, Hyrulean civil war and that's when where the occurring of time comes in with that we have the sacred realm of um, becomes the dark world and Ganondorf becomes the uh, demon king Ganon and then it breaks it again into the the heroes def uh, the hero has been defeated and that's un under the child era and the decline of Hyrule and the last of the heroes starting with the impri um, imprisoning war and we have a link a link to the past which is the resurrection of Ganon and this is on the era of um, light and dark we also have the Oracle of Ages and Oracle of Seasons, which is the resurrection of Ganon. Under the Golden Era, we have Link's Awakening. And of course, the uh, monarchs of Hyrule uh, used the Triforce. And on the um, era of gear of decline, there's the tragedy of Princess Zelda the first, which is the legend of Zelda, the resurrection of Ganon, the adventures of Link, the resurrection of Ganon is prevented. Huh, no wonder why he fight Link. Uh, fights his shadow instead of Ganon. That's interesting. 
And with that, Mark's the, uh, the hero is triumph, uh, triumphant. Um, which shoots out to the uh, adult era. The sacred realm uh, remains protected. With that, we have the twilight of the realm and the legacy of the hero. That's where um, Majora's Mask comes in. Then the demon, uh, demon thief Ganondorf is executed. On the Twilight Era, we have Twilight Princess, the Shadow of Invasion, followed by the Shadow Era, which we have Four Swords Adventures. That's the right nation of Ganondorf and the resurrection of Patty. Then that time Ganondorf is sealed. With that comes the hero of the winds and the new world and the new world. In the era of the Without a hero, we have Ganondorf is resurrected, Hyrule is sealed, and then fall flooded. On the year of the uh, year of the Great Sea, we have the Wind Waker, and Ganon is resurrected. Oh, Ganondorf is resurrected. At the same time, there's Phantom Hourglass. On the air of the great, uh, great Voyage, um, a new continent was discovered. And at the same time, a new Hyrule uh, Kingdom is founded. And on the era of Hyrule's rebirth, there's of course uh, spirit track uh, tracks. That's uh, Demon King Maladis is resurrected. So that's that's the breakdown as I know for now. The chronology of uh, Hyrule, according to the Zelda games, but there's more games that came out, and there were some that there were some actually that were not included. For example, um, Link's Crossbow Training. According to, to this, the series contained few spin-offs of the game, such as uh, Link's Crossbow Training, that had not been included in these chronicles. Uh, Okay. I'm re where I got this, the chronology, check this out. It's, uh, it's called a chronology of Hyrule, land of the gods, the history of cycle of rebirth and the Triforce. So basically it's 
saying uh, how everything started and also the, um, the existence of the Triforce. No. I'm gonna read this section from the from um, the book. This is a telling of tales and passed on through the ages by humans. This is an introduction to the history of Hyrule, told chronologically which ways together with together numerous legend of Zelda stories. It is it is it a legend? Is it an accurate history of cycle of rebirth? There's evidence that the story of the legend of Zelda begins with Sky World sword uh, Sky Skyward Sword up to this point. The legend of Zelda has been surrounded by myth and mystery, but now with the help of the following information, you will be able to discover for yourself the real history of Hyrule. Um, Okay, according to this, let me read that section and uh, these other two sections. This chronicle may co collect information that is believed to be true at this time, and there are many obscure and unanswered secrets that still within the tale, as the stories of storytellers of Hyrule changed so too does its history. Hyrule's history is a continuously woven tapestry of events, changes that seem in inconsequential disregarded without even truck could evolve at some point to hatch new legends and perhaps change this tapestry of history itself. Basically it's set up one way and because there are more games besides the ones that were mentioned throughout the chronology um, it might have changed. Um, so I don't know exactly about about the new book, the updated version. Sadly enough, this is the one I got. And it gives you a great detail. You can it talks to you about every game and the story that's behind behind um behind it So, like I said, that's that's what I can, what I know about the chronology so far. And I also ask myself, is this is it, or there's there are any changes whatsoever, and how did it really start? <clears throat> so. 
Um, that'll be it. That'll be it. And I hope this might clear some questions you might have had about the uh, Legends of Zelda. Hopefully it gave you some idea as how the story is standing so far. So <clears throat> if you like this video or any of my videos, you guys know what to do. Questions, answers, uh, I mean questions, concerns. Let me know. Um, also, I'm open to do other stuff. I did mention on my last video that I was going to uh, do some reviews on music videos. Um, and I just had one in mind, but I really got carried away right now. I've been busy with other things and I haven't um, thought about it lately or I've been thinking about it, but I, it's been weird. And I have more, plenty of videos to come out. I mean, tons. Anyway, you're...